good morning, mother. I know. I know. I know what you're probably thinking right now. This motherfucker has been AFK for literally a month. She's not doing any videos about AI or FM anymore. What the fuck is this kid doing? I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, but not sorry at the same time. I was working in my agency. I was not AFK. I was not inactive. You know, I was not just doing shit and chilling in Dubai. Of course, I was working in my agency. My agency tripled the, the revenue compared to the two months ago. Yes, two months ago. Compared to two months ago, my agency is making three more times money. Easy as! So you guys have way more knowledge than before. Now, you guys have way more knowledge than before. I have so much to teach to you guys. This is why I'm back. And this is why now I'm engaging literally myself to make a video every single two days. Mark my words. Every single two days, I will make a video. If it doesn't happen, I need to give money to the community and I will give you $1,000 giveaway on Instagram. Okay? Instagram is in the, in the description. If I don't make a video every two days till end of May, till the 1st June, I will give you $1,000 giveaway on Instagram. Okay? And you know you guys. No bullshit. No shit. So yeah, uh, also, first of all, if you want to talk to me, if you want to work with my agency, uh, especially if you want to work with my agency, if you want to connect with me because you do well in business, if you want to connect with me because you live in Dubai, just hit me up on Instagram, okay? My Instagram is in the description, message me there. All right, let's start. You know you guys, straight to the point, I'm back with the best video ever about the AOFM space. Why I'm doing the video about Infion AI? It's because Infion AI is literally right now making a fucking revolution they they are destroying everything if infinite ai changed the AOFM game so much this is the best tool ever created in the AOFM space and i will explain you why let's go this video is way shorter because i'm just like making an overview tutorial about infinite ai but if you like this video if you appreciate and if if this video helps you actually just leave a comment in, and if I see that a lot of people like the, the video, then I will do way longer tutorial. Okay? Easy as, you know, you guys. All right, let's start. So, we're going to start with generate an image, generate an AI model. Okay? So, if you have a prompt in your mind, then you can just write the prompt as I do here and get the picture. But if you don't have prompt, you can generate prompt. Okay? You can just go on CBT AI, take a picture, you pick a picture, and you get there, you drop the picture here. And Infinite AI will, romp, will write sorry, the prompt for you. Easy as. You can also recreate an image. Let's say you see a beautiful model and you want to recreate her. You can just drop the reference image here and describe what, um, how to say, specificity you want on your model. Then it will literally slightly change the model, but you're going to recreate um, almost the same image. Sorry, easy as. But let's start with this one. To generate your AI model, what you can do is use a prompt builder. I can choose whatever I want here. You can also get to ChatGPT and ask for a prompt. Or you can just write your prompt as I did. You know? Blonde girl. Blonde girl. Blue eyes. Staring to her phone. Staring to her iPhone 15. Um, smiling. Blah, 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 blah. Show advanced options. If you are a beginner, I wouldn't advise you to use advanced option. But if you are more, let's say, skilled, then use advanced option. Especially for Loras. Loras are insane. And for those who don't know what's a Lora, I will show you later in the video what's a Lora. Okay? But using a Lora is very good to generate way more advanced images for your model and keep the same model. Okay? All right. So the number of images I would advise you to use just one okay but maybe two it's not bad because you will have more choice use max one or two not four it will take so long to generate so the aspect ratio if you are for if you if you're generating these images for instagram just keep this aspect ratio if it's more for youtube and shit then i will i will more go to a landscape okay but this one is for instagram so i will keep this one what's the seed the seed is pretty simple look okay you can see yeah, you can see what's written. All right. So what's the seed? Let's say I generate a picture. I really like the picture and I want to generate a similar picture. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy the seed because once you generate an image, I will show you um, where is the seed. But it gives you the seed. 
and you can reuse the same seed in order to generate the similar images um, for the next images that you want to generate. Okay? I feel like my English is getting better. Let's go. All right. So, uh, as I told you here, you can recreate image, any image that you see on, on, on social media or on, on, or on the internet. It doesn't have to be an AI model, you know. Any pictures that you see, you can just get there and recreate the image. Easy as. For, for the generating video, this is the most important and interesting tool. Okay? And I will show you later why, because I already have some results. So all you have to do is drop your image again here, the reference image. So once you generate an image here, you get this girl. You, go, you, you, you download the picture and you get to the generate video and drop the picture here. You describe what you want in the video. What I would say, uh, I think, which is good for real, and especially if you know what's trending right now on Instagram, is AI models. If you run an AI model and you post a 100% AI model and you say it's AI, Instagram is boosting you. The algorithm is putting you um, more on advantage, let's say. The algorithm is boosting your post. So this is why lately you're seeing a lot of AI models blowing up just with feed posts and shit without even reels. It's because Instagram lately is boosting AI models. So don't hesitate to create your AI model ASAP because I'm pretty sure you can get results very fast. So describe the video. Usually what you will ask is um, dancing, dancing, smiling, um, smiling, uh, moving her head moving uh, and blah 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 okay then you will choose the video length i would advise you to do 10 seconds because at least if the first um if the last three seconds of the video you don't like you can make it shorter but if you choose five seconds you fuck because what you need to do is recreate another another video because you can't post a three seconds video on the social media you know so it's better to generate a 10 seconds video. So for the post trait, um, I will keep I will keep this one. It's better for Instagram. Okay. Let's say you generate you generate an image and you really like it. What you can do is I will download. You really like it, but um, you want to keep it and use it. Don't use it straight. I would advise you if you don't like anything in the image, first of all to in paint. Okay. Let's say um, I don't like the teeth of the model. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to color the teeth, you see. I'm going to paint here. Then I will get there, fix the teeth, make them, make them, make them whiter, etc, etc. And, and what the internet AI will do for you is it will make the teeth uh, more perfect and it will whiten, it will whitener, whitening, I don't even know what, how do we say this word. Bro, I need to train my English way more, bro. Holy shit, what the goat is doing lately. But um, it will make the teeth of the model way more white. Okay, easy as. Bro, my English was fucking insane. It's because lately I was fucking, I was fucking lazy about posting on social media. The more videos, YouTube videos I do, the better my English gets. So fuck, bro, I have a crazy English and I'm not practicing anymore. I'm just practicing with my business partners and people working in my agency, but uh, bro, like I'm not really practicing because I'm not making like long form videos such as YouTube right now to practice better my English. Fuck bro. That's why I'm telling you every, every two days I'm posting a new YouTube video now. Fuck it. All right. So like, as you can see, um, you just, you just post your picture and you perfect your image. Okay. You can, you can correct whatever you want. Let's say I don't like this picture is pretty perfect, but let's say I don't like her hair. What I can do is uh, make her ginger and she will get ginger and the results are pretty crazy. I'm telling you. Okay. So let's say I like the picture. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to upscale. Okay. If you want to use any picture, never use it straight. First of all, upscale it, make it better quality, then use the picture. Okay, if you don't upscale it, the quality will be bad. And if you don't know about social media, the better quality you post, the better reach will be. Okay, the reach will be insane if the quality is insane, but the reach won't be good if the picture is not good, the quality is not good. Okay, so always upscale your images. Even if your physical model changes, like send you content on Telegram or whatever, if you want to post on IG, always upscale first the image, then post on IG. This is very important. You just pay someone to do it for you, like 50 bucks, and he needs to upscale 100 images straight. 
you know, easier. So uh, here what you can do is you can upscale the image, but with creativity, you can slightly change the image, but I wouldn't advise you to, ch to touch this. You, you know, if you're upscaling any image, you're doing that because you want to make it better quality, you know, not change anything on the image. So no creativity, just upscale. Then you hit upscale. Okay. So I will show you now. I will show you now. You can also face swap with uh, Intrain AI, which is also very insane because if, with Intrain AI, you can literally do whatever you want and whatever you have in mind. You want to face swap? Okay, you can face swap. You want to generate images? Okay, you can generate image. You can literally do anything related, everything I would say even, everything related to AI or FM, you can do it here. So that's why Intrain AI is just insane. Um, so you can face swap just right there. You put the source image here. So the source image is the image um, that you want to put the face on, okay? And this is the face image, okay? The face that you want to swap. Um, train. So we are getting to the most important and interesting parts, okay? So what's a LoRa? LoRa is pretty simple. LoRa is a model that you can create in order to generate consistent images with your own style for your own AI model for your AI or FM agency, okay? If you, run to, if you want to run a proper AI or FM agency, you need to train a LoRa model. So the LoRa model will be always able to generate consistent characters for you. And how to say, uh, very advanced images. Okay, the quality will be good. Uh, it will be very similar or literally identical to your AI model with the same face, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So you need to train the LoRa ASAP and you need to start using Infinite AI, especially for the LoRa models, because Infinite AI, I think, to train the LoRa is literally the best. So I will explain later in the video because it takes way more time to explain how to train the LoRa and how to use it perfectly and get the best output from it. So as I told you guys, if you like this video and you think that you need a tutorial on LoRa model, just leave a comment and I will make a full step AOFM guide about Infinite AI and how to get the best output from it. Okay? Easy as. Alright, so now I will show you all the results that you can get from Infinite AI. As you guys can see, all of this, you maybe won't believe, but all of this is fucking AI. Look, this image is not even upscaled. This image is not even upscaled and as you guys can see, it's already so fucking real. It looks very real. Look. I just said blonde girl selfie holding an iPhone 15, smiling. I haven't even been precise. Do you guys realize the power of this fucking tool? Look at this. She doesn't even look fake. That's insane. That's insane. Do you guys realize? It looks so real that let's say you have a fan asking you on fan view, yeah, can you take a picture for me? like a face verification picture, just hold your phone in your room right now and take it now. You can send this picture. You understand? You can generate the picture and send it. Easy as. That's insane. Look at these models, guys, that I've generated. They all look so real. And you can already use this type of content for the OF feed, you know? You can use this content for the feed. Let's say we see this model. This image is not upscaled. What I'm going to do first, I'm going to in-paint it. I in-paint and I will change the teeth, okay? I will make the teeth more perfect. As you guys can see, the teeth doesn't look that good. So I will paint the teeth and perfect the teeth, blah, blah. Once it's, once it's done, I will get the upscale and I will upscale the picture and the quality will be way better and the picture will be way better, you know? All the content that you see here is not upscale. I will get the upscale images and you will understand, you know? So look at this model. Do you see the quality with upscaling? Do you guys realize the power of Infinite AI now? This shit is insane. Look at the details. Look at the details. This is insane. The quality is just insane. As, and as I told you earlier, the better is the quality, the better is this you're gonna get. So make sure to always upscale images and pictures. So the face swap image is pretty easy. Uh, you already know how the face swap works, but we're gonna check this. Let's check this out. So as you guys see, I took this picture, okay, I didn't even upscale it, I took this picture. And I just put on the prompt, and I just put on the prompt, uh, move your head, I just put move your head, and five second video. I could make it way longer, it could be way better, but five second video, 
you guys can see it's so fucking real it's so fucking real how i could uh, change this and make it better and uh, upgrade the prompt what i would say to make this video more, more realistic i would say move faster you know i will tell the model to move faster and um, uh, i will make it i will make it move faster and also maybe yeah bro i think it's literally the only needed thing i will ask infinity ai to make the model move faster but it's, it's insane look at this it's insane look how realistic this shit looks guys keep in mind it's just the image to video what you can do you can generate 10 seconds video and make the video look a little bit more um, more realistic by increasing the speed okay make it like make the speed way higher in instead of putting one put 1.1 or 1.2 now don't go more than 1.2 i think 1.1 or 1.2 is the best and it will look way more realistic as you guys can see this video is coming to the end i think it's literally the best tool ever and especially for the lora so if you want to know how to use lora and how to train the lora let me know in the comments i hope you guys loved that video and it will be very helpful to you my full step lfm guide is in the description take care i love you bye